And after flooding and storm damage from January, the IRS has once again extended the tax deadline for most Californians now, pushing it back to October 16th. The new deadline is meant to give those recovering from the storms more time to file their personal income and business tax returns. But it will be a challenge for state leaders as they try to figure out how to spend the taxpayer dollars this upcoming budget year. And with that in mind, Case Area 3 Capital Correspondent Ashley Zavala joins us now in the studio to explain what that all means, Ashley. Golston and Andrea, this basically means the state's already complicated budget situation is going to be made even more complicated by this extension. State lawmakers and the governor rely on that traditional tax deadline in April to help figure out the state spending plan that's due this summer. But now that that deadline has been pushed back nearly six months, state leaders say they'll have to put together the budget without key information. Here are the deadlines the state relies on to figure out how to spend your taxpayer dollars. Governor Gavin Newsom is required to roll out the final version of his proposed budget in May. The legislature must pass the state spending plan by June 15th, and the budget goes into effect July 1st. State officials note these deadlines cannot and will not change because of this IRS delay. California is also facing a potential budget shortfall of about 25 billion dollars, according to the latest data provided by the California Department of Finance. State leaders say California is in a healthy financial position to weather these challenges with billions in the rainy day fund, tens of billions, I should say. But they know that not having those key dollar amounts they're used to having in April is going to be an obstacle. It just means that the one critical piece of data isn't going to be there uh, as it is in normal years. And we're going to have to try to make some more projections and assumptions because the cash we would normally have in the bank in April, we're not going to receive until perhaps mid-October. Now, hearings are underway at the state capitol for the next several months to figure out how to spend your taxpayer dollars. But again, officials note those, neg those negotiations and those hearings this year will happen without the full financial picture. Back to you. Yeah, big snag there. Thanks, Ashley.